And then now, you know, the guys, what they know, they say, you're yeah, penny raw. And then most of the ladies know, you're yeah, penny raw. Because that one, you know, you let me call with my Philip, the alacratis of the diabolism. Now, me see, wait. And then after that, you know, you receive the HIV and the gonorrhea and the syphilis diabolically. HIV is rampant in the country. Gonorrhea is rampant in the country. Syphilis, just to mention, but a few. Some of these. STIs, you no, know, in the boss mind. The person who get diabetes, they go look for sugar daddy. This I see create a sign now. Person be good about the system, no more. Surviving is winning, Franklin. Everything else is bullshit. Fairy tales spun by people who are afraid to look life in the eye. Whatever you taste, it survive. 60,000 sex workers in the country. Hey, so does it mean we have 60,000 HIV or gonorrhea syphilis sharing? Mm, I didn't see that. I, I didn't see that. I said, do we have 60,000 sex workers in the country? And do you know who is not infected? And do you know who have sex with somebody and the person doesn't protect? You receive it diabotically and then you alacratically analyze it into your system. Your immune system can defend that. So right now, HIV, gonorrhea, syphilis, you want it raw. Celebrate, no, you can put it like, yeah, because that is what you guys are saying. I'm not the one, these are not my words because they said they need, they want it raw. Raw, open raw. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get into today's video. Kindly hit on the subscribe button and like the video. Let's head into it right now. Today, you know, the news where the trend for the country top and be say sex workers in the country is now brutal. It's now brutal. Yes, I saw this post about the sex workers in the country. So, and then on one of my friends' status, he's an upcoming musician. Um, he's called Marvine. We me are checking out on you know YouTube platform Marvine. We the papa. So he posted and said, "Stop trading your body for money because you are not Bitcoin." <laughs> like seriously. <laughs> but this thing it they enter my brain, pal. Because some of the ladies, if they see this. They will say, ah, man, yeah, Bitcoin is saying, nah, like, you know. He said, stop trading your body for money because you are not Bitcoin. When you go to the outside world, this sex working thing, it happened for them. We know they blame them. But right now, no, them, they go through proper means and screening. So before you go, go say you go do self working for maybe UK, United States, or whatever, no. Them go take you through some screening processes and make sure that you are free from infection and then you are ready to go and do a job that is different. But right now, what we're talking about is not even about registration. People they do these things for everywhere with them that like them. Anybody if you do this thing, government is not even aware of some of these people. So when we 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 have to address some of these things, it's if it's, it's, it's factual and then it's what the government should be looking forward to dealing with because most of the things that are happening in the country is never important right now what is trending they will tell you that napo said nana akufuadu the president of the republic of ghana have done better than dr kwame nkrumah the ostagi he didn't even say dr kwame nkrumah the president of ghana your president when Dr. Kwame Nkrumah is an icon, he's a man of many sides. How many African presidents can you compare to Dr. Kwame Nkrumah? Then there's nobody. Oh yeah, if you have different view of this, you can sit down and consume it. But that is the fact. When you go to Zambia, I was walking around Facebook and I saw this. Dr. Kwame Nkrumah's status is in Zambia. And then we can to again. I forgot. How many African presidents have you seen their status somewhere to be celebrated? Do you know who that man is? 
Please, we are not talking about that Napo and then no, let's put that one aside because we'll go to the politicians aspect. I will be dealing with matters that Charlie, if I'm not careful, I'm bomb soon one day. So right now, let's hit on the matter. The sex working job in the country, the government in relation to this. What can be done? That is what we should be looking forward to. Now, it's simple. The government creating job for these people who are vulnerable to activities like this will solve the issue of you know sex working job in the country. Today you are recording 60,000. Tomorrow, do you know the number you record? And this is not even accurate figure. This is an estimation. You can't tell me that this is the total in Ghana. No, it can't be because we know, you know that they are more than that. Because my area like this, they didn't come there to investigate people. So you can't tell me that that is the exact number. So now, this sex working team, have you think about the consequences? Now, not to the person doing it, but you. Because your life is at risk and you need to talk to the government to come and then secure job for these people and get them out of the street in practicing these activities. Somebody if you go have sex with somebody without protection and the person will get gonorrhea or syphilis. And the next thing that will happen to the person, no, you will not understand. Because what? You might get erectile dysfunction. So now let's come to talk about the chairman, HIV. Because that is what is trending globally and that is what is deadly. But right now people are not afraid of that one because under management conditions they can sustain to live with this condition without any effect. Because up today you they see people plus HIV and then they are normal. They are even healthy than someone walking without HIV virus. Because of treatments that have been put in place. And that is the system we want, uh, you know, globally. So we are training health workers in the country, nurses, doctors, midwives, so on and so forth. And still, we are having this high rate of, you know, sexual activities happening in the country without protection. Because your life is at risk. Because someone will go to, I mean, roll out a sugar daddy just to get what she or she likes what she likes and then she'll come and give it to you innocently you are sitting somewhere without any problem the person will go to a sugar daddy carry it and come and give it to you because you can't tell me that you go to a sugar daddy and tell him what to do say on for condom and share or no no on pet dada he won't give you raw and then most of them knows very well that them get infection but so them go carry give you so that you too you will go suffer for life you want the money they will give you but they will give you something bigger than that you understand? So these are some of the things we're talking about. Until right now, you know, the best way to solve this, you know, in fact, these people, it's not their fault. Yes, I understand, despite the unfortunate things that we are talking about, the criticism and some of the unexpected things we are pointing out to you, know, when you come to look at the aspect, say, these people, they go through this, you know, it's not their fault, it's not their personal decision. Some of them go because they don't have any other option. And some of them, that is their last Arrow. I mean, that's their last option. They have to go and give out themselves and get money to do what they want to do because their parents self can't get money for them and there's no job somewhere. So why not the government come in place, create entrepreneurial, I mean, skills, let the people get job to do, especially the youth, the young girls and females because the people where you know say they go inject themselves in these things, you know, that is what we should be focusing on. And then you can prevent if so I think say if a lady is there and the person can raise money in maybe entrepreneurial activities to get a part, to get a shirt, to get a pant, because you can be on this pant Because sometimes men self no with a bleed. Talking of women. So if men they bleed her, women they they will do like this because the system no good for them. You understand? So if the government, I mean Put these things in place, uh, it will help. But if we are not cautious of the things what that is happening right now, no, the future, we have to be afraid of it. Because you ask yourself, where is this ending? Surviving is winning, Franklin. Everything else is bullshit. Fairy tales spanned by people who are afraid to look life in the eye. Whatever it takes, kids. Survive. 
fairy tales spun by people who are afraid to look life in the eye. Whatever it takes, kids, survive. Yes, so ladies and gentlemen, yes. If this is your first time visiting this channel, yes, my name is Richie Randy, and this episode is brought to you by Joy Ideas. Kindly hit on the subscribe button. You know what to do, and turn on the notification bell. We keep you updated. Anything and information you need at any point in time, we send it out to you, and you feel the vibe. But then, you also have something to say. Can you let us discuss that in the comment section? Come, let's vibe in the comment section, and we will feel the vibe too. See you next time in our next video.